In this video we gonna show, how to configure inline electromagnetic integral flow meter. For entering to meter program, first need to unlock the meter. So please watch the unlocking video of meter, we provide the link in the i button. Once entered in the program, the first setting is for language, the default language is English. Next is communication address, there is a provision to set communication address in between 1 to 99. And this communication address is used for RS-485 communication. And next setting is baud rate, the available baud rates are 600, 1200, 2400, 4800, 9600, and 19200. The default setting is 9600. Next option is sensor size. In that nominal diameter of the flange already configured. Next is flow unit, in this menu select the flow rate units. For entering through a particular setting press enter button, and use up and down button for change the parameter and again press enter button for return to main menu. Next is flow range, it is also configured as per standards from factory. And the next one is flow responses. It's the time interval in second at which the hold values of display parameters. The default value is 8 seconds. The next is flow direct. In this menu available two options are forward and reverse. When we select forward option, the flow that same direction of arrow mark in flow tube consider as positive flow. And if we select reverse option, reverse flow consider as positive flow. Next is flow zero. This configured from factory. The flow cut off value set in terms of percentage, it is also calibrated from factory. This menu for cut off enable or disable setting. Next is total unit menu. In this menu, need to select proper flow total units and multipliers. The available units are liter, meter cube, US gallon and UK gallon. Select desired multiplier. Next option is segment enable. In this menu are got the provision to enable and disable the reverse flow. In next menu analog type offers the current output selection. The meter have provision for selecting two types of output currents. They are 4 to 20 mA, 1 to 10 mA. Next is pulse type. In program, it has the provision for selecting two kind of analog output, one is pulse and other is frequency. Next menu is pulse factor, in this menu we choose the proper pulse unit. In frequency menu, we need to select upper limit of frequency range and it's also in between 1 to 5000. This menu used to enable or disable the empty pipe alarm. In upcoming menus, we have the provision to set high and low alarm values of flow rate, and it's configured in terms of percentage. All the remaining program configured by the factory. Thank you.